It was as cloudy as the Yarra River this morning here in Melbourne. That, that sure has changed. Clearing and sunny is what they called for this morning. That's exactly what's happened. As you can see, it's bathed in sunshine right now. Some northeasterly winds are about 80 degrees Fahrenheit, but I think it's going to get a little warmer than that. The roof. Oh, he oh. got it, James. Running forehand, the best shot running forehand in tennis by a long way belongs to Pete Sampras. Break point. He got the passing shot and has broken back, and it's two games all. What a shot, because it was an excellent serve and a yep. fine volley. It's exactly what Sampras wanted to do. He gets the first serve here, look, two and the volley. Pushes it down, three-quarter course. It was deeper than that, and uh, Agassi just gives no ground. Look at this. He nearly half volleys this. Look, shoulder turn, watches that, the head still, and you know as soon as he hit that, he made it. The fact is that Pete Sampras, he will hit that volley against most anybody in the business and yeah. not expect to see what he just saw, and that's why he wasn't ready for it. Five, four, Sampras, and he'll serve two. Seven's the magic number. Sampras held his ground, and he had alternatives, Fred. Why would he do that, Agassi? Well, he probably thought he's got to hit it as hard as he could. He plays a drop volley. Not a good choice of shots. This one gets thumped right at him, but look at the reflexes there. And he picked it right off his right hip. That's where they tell you if you're going to hit the ball at anybody, you hit it at their right hip. Agassi did everything perfectly in that stroke, and Sampras got out of the way and was able to make the volley. Set point here for Sampras. Sampras steps back. Yeah. Thank you, Thank you Folks shouting from the crowd to him. Oh, what a return of serve, and Agassi's still alive in the tiebreak. He's serving at 5-6. That one hit the tape on the way over, too. It went out wide to the forehand. The forehand down the line struck the tape. And again, it's set up by the return of serve. Sampras is uh, only able to take a half volley off this one, and uh, Agassi is in great position. Look at that, half volley, and he gets there and rips this one down the line, and uh, there's a pretty lethargic Pete Sampras because he's still hanging around that service line area. So big opportunity now for Agassi. Two break points. He got it. That's if, a stab in the dark, that one. That one. <laughs> you got that right. If, Ag if Sampras comes back and wins it, Fred, that's going to be a turning point. <laughs> stab in the dark, that one. That ball was behind him. Oh! She's third break point opportunity here. This is break point number 20 in the match. Miss hit, or was it good enough anyway down the line? Brad Gilbert is out of his chair as he recognizes that Agassi the Great is going to serve for the championship here at the Australian Open. That's the third set, the tiebreaker in the third set. Sampras had a couple of set points, couldn't hold them. Agassi came through with some brilliant stuff, and he's just kept the pressure on. Last service game, Sampras got back. To Deuce with a brilliant half volley, stab shot. Agassi again kept it on, and he serves an ace to win it. He just did it. A terrific effort, Mary Carilla. I, I, I'm proud of him. I'm proud of both these men, and, uh, but especially Agassi. I mean, he's really, uh, he has earned my respect, boy. Andre Agassi, tennis wins here, and uh, you can see him with the group there, but the, I mentioned it before, these four players, Agassi, Courier, Sampras, and a few of the other boys that are there, just incredible friends. They play the sport the way it's meant to be played. This has been a tournament to remember as Andre Agassi wins it in four sets. He lost the first 6-4, then 6-1. He was down two set points in the third set tiebreaker, came back to win it. 
and it's 6-4 in the fourth set. Pete Sampras losing to Andre Agassi in the first Grand Slam of this year. Agassi a winner of the men's singles.